For instance, if you go to where we have over there, you see on the main road, they have the main road, which is FR. And then we have the Sun Road, which is at an angle. And then we have the we have the Juba Road, which is at a perpendicular to the main road. Now the Juba Road, as you are well aware, of, just so you can turn at an angle to from the side road or slip road, as it's called, into a main road, you are going to have a curvature, a quadrant, a semicircle, a quarter circle taken out of that section of the road. So you can see the hatch line showing 111. This work says that take all take off and square everything fully in accordance with season three. The season three basically is the civil engineering standard method of measurement, the um, edition three that we are currently using. And I introduced the question, this particular question for I said we should do caps, but our concentration is on how to demolish and how to carry out earthwork. When you come down a bit, we have studied and we are going to recollect now that every project has a title. So you cannot measure without a title. Every project has a title. Every project definitely is located in a certain place. Definitely located somewhere, meaning that you are going to construct a road. So construction of um, proposed construction of maybe uh, a seven classroom block located in Kweku Chrome. Kweku Chrome is the location. Sometimes for a place like Kweku Chrome, it will be so vast such that it has suburbs. Accra, most of you are in Accra. If you are going to do anything in Accra, you will not say construction of a six classroom block in Accra. Accra is very vast. And probably for most of us, Accra ends, Accra Central is very far away from where we live. The way you want to say, you will say at Legon. Legon is still Accra, but it's not Accra because it's a suburb of Accra. A municipality within Accra, okay? So we have location. So in this case, Kuni Oti is the region. The every project has a reference. Every project has a reference. The reference, as you, you are well aware, I did ask several times, sorry. I did ask several times. several times if we can remember to have referencing. And you would see that when you take a, a drawing, at the bottom of the drawing, at the bottom of the drawing, you have the legend. If you do not see, if you do not see, uh, uh, how do you call it? A reference in the form of atu.dce slash gd slash 01, a reference of the sort, sometimes you will see 001, drawing number 002. And here is the case you work in, your drawings you use are drawing number 1 to 20. So your reference are architectural drawings number 1 to 20. That's your reference. The reference from which you are carrying out the work. Emmanuel, you sit down. You will not be able to follow if you are getting up and down and going back and forth. Rona. So you have your date, and then of course, the date. It's that you have whoever carried out the taking off. So you can see taking off by, and then you put the name there. Then for a takeoff list, 